Hey guys, Igor here, doing one more AppStormer review. Today, analyzing Mailer Cloud, a tool that claims to send effective email campaigns with a powerful email marketing solution. Mailer Cloud is a powerful email marketing platform that lets you create professionally designed email campaigns that grow your subscribers list. It claims to be an alternative to mail literal, constant contact, and send grids. The limits are good, so let's check out how the deal works. You have up to license tier 4, and if you buy more codes, you get more contacts, so you can add more contacts to your list and grow your businesses. You have unlimited emails, so the limit here are, is not related to the number of emails that you can send per month, but actually to the number of contacts. More codes or tiers, more contacts. And that's a feature here. You need to get at least tier 2 to remove the Mailer Clown branding. So if you plan to buy that deal, buy at least the tier number 2. The limits are good. With the tier 4, you get 50 contacts and it costs $269. So let's check out the tool. As you can see here is the dashboard and they suggest you follow those steps. So first you add your audience, so add in your contact, then you authenticate your domain, create your sender ID to have better reputation and then create your first campaign. Those are the usually steps that you need to follow to create an email marketing campaign. And this is not a cold email outreach tool, but an email marketing tool. So you're not going to send email to people that you don't know, but actually send email to people that you know and that already allowed you to email them. For instance, subscribing to your email list or engaging with your latest promo. Here you can see how you can create a list and then add contacts. Here there is a default list that I created. If you want, just click here to create a new list on the top right. And then you can select your type of contact. Usually they are active and your list name. Then when you create your list, you can upload your CSV to add your contact, copy and paste your contact or add individual content one by one. For instance, adding here a new contact is pretty simple. You just add your email if you want the first and the last name. And you can add author, also the phone number, the country, and also other properties like middle name, city, state, and industry. Those features you can use to customize your email campaign, for instance, uh, using a first name code to default code to uh, address your contacts by their first name. And then pretty simple, you can add contacts as you can see here as usually as all email marketing tools. Everything here you do on the audience tabs and you can also segment your audience. You can, for instance, use segments to send emails to two lists at the same time and creating a segment name with the two lists. You can also add conditions to personalize that segment. So if the subscriber's status is open it, you can send an email between those two lists only to, to people who open it some of your emails. The segment is created. This is a way to better personalize the kind of contacts that you want to send on a specific email campaign. They also have email forms and you can use those forms to add automatically subscribers to your contact list. And those forms can be embedded on your website, be a standalone page, use as a pop-up box, a sliding left box, sliding right box, and a drop-down banner on your website. For the sake of that review, I'm going to choose standalone page and you add the name of your form. And here you can see that you can pretty easy create a new form 
to as on a, on a stone alone page to collect more contacts. You can see here that they have templates. So a newsletter sign up, for instance, you can select an um, ebook download contact form, a support contact form, event registration con contact form, and you can create based on those templates. Then in, as you can see here, you can better personalize adding features like country. So you add another field on your contact form. So you can create forms and use it to add those contacts directly to your email list on Mailer Cloud. Pretty, using a pretty simple dashboard that you can preview your form usually as any contact form tool. You can also stylish your contact form, change the font, change the color to better fit your branding. And when you are ready, you can just click here on save as draft. Here on the left, you can see that you can display a thank you message or re redirect the user to another page after the they fill out your form. When you are ready, you just click here on save as draft. Here on the left, you can see that they have regular campaigns, automations, and autoresponders. So you can use as a SendGrid tool, for instance, or to send your newsletter. They are pretty flexible. Here is to create an autoresponder, for example. Here you can set up your automation. I'm going to click here to test one automation. You just choose your audience first. Let's choose our AppSumo list. You can select if you want to send to new contacts only, existing contacts only, or both. So let's send to both. You can select the time settings of your automation workflow. So they are starting today and then finished, for instance, in, in the end of that month. And here is where you're going to create your automation. So here is where the sequence will start and then you can immediately, uh, that will be the first step, add a campaign. Okay, so you're going to immediately, after starting the sequence, sending a campaign to your user, and then you will design your email. On automations, for instance, you can just send an email, um, and then that will be your first campaign and then wait four days. And for those who open in your email, you want to send another email. So you do just create a whole workflow to send emails using the automation features. And for autoresponders, for instance, someone buy, buy a, new, a new deal on your e-commerce website or someone subscribed to your emailing list and they automatically will receive an email. I'm going to show you now the template gallery so you can see the kind of emails that they have. Here's a wedding letter email, a woman's day email, a gift card code email. Here's a membership email template. They are kind of kind of cute. A recent purchase email for your autoresponder, for instance, you can see it here. A news blog email. So you can see here they have many, many templates on their website, many possibilities as a donate, email, newsletters, call center, download reports. So you're going to find here um, any template for your needs. There are many, many, many templates. You can see here how it works. I'm going to select that newsfeed template. So if you want to create a, a campaign using that template as base, you just need to click here to create campaign. And then you can see their builder. Create a campaign, you need to validate your email and you do it at your email websites where you're going to send your emails and then you need to add your their DNS record. It's pretty simple. If you already know how to add DNS, you need to add three names and two texts to verify your domain and verifying it, you will be able to create new campaigns. You can add a pixel to track your campaigns. They allow you to add a new API key and they have those integrations. You can integrate Mailer Cloud with the peer, WordPress, Public Connect, Integrately, MailChimp, Google Sheets, Facebook, Connect, HubSpot, Zoho, Shopify, Typeform, 
Salesforce, Woofoo Forms, Intercom, Gravity Forms, Google Forms, and Stripe. So we can use all those tools to automate your campaign. Unfortunately, I will not be able to show you the campaign builder because I would need to verify my domain and they are they are already uh, verifying my el eligibility and I can't add my domain by now. So it's just a, an overview that you can see how the Mailer Cloud works. So it's a pretty standard email marketing tool. You're not going that to going to use that tool to create cold email. No, you're going to send to people that you are add, added to your mailing list. So they are you are allowed to send email to them. And the campaigns can be regular automations or autoresponders. Autoresponders are those who are automatically people buy from your website and they will really cloud you just send an email to them or they subscribe to your mailing list. Mailer Cloud will send an email to them or also automation. So you can create a whole email campaign complex with different kind of dates. And also if people open their email or not, for instance, you can create campaigns and also a regular campaign, for instance, send news to your subscribers. So if you don't have SendGrid, if you don't have MoveSend, if you want a new email marketing tool, Mail Cloud would be an option for you. I hope you liked that review. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.